So yeah, this woman call in to Angela Yee's show and is talking about, you know, she's married for 10 years and oh boy, what she is doing to her husband is so foul. Let's review it. I've been married for over 10 years. Okay, congrats. And I have been sleeping with my husband's cousin. What? Oh. So for a little, well, we known each other for a long time before I met my husband. And I didn't know that was his cousin. Mm. And I got a kid by him. You are so dumb. You are really dumb. For real. Wow. So whose kid does your husband think it is? His. He thinks it's his baby. Oh, my God. He don't know it's his cousin. Wait a minute. So you're, you have a child by your husband's cousin. But your, your husband, husband is raising it. it as though it's his own. Oh, my gosh. Yep. So what does the cousin think about all this? Is he wanting to, like, reveal it? And this is why a lot of men say that a law needs to be pushed where they have mandatory DNA tests before a man can sign a birth certificate. That's why. And there's a lot of women that don't want that because they know the dirty deeds they be doing out here. And there's a lot of men that have found out that a kid wasn't theirs. If these women think they got away with it, you know another website that be busting them out? Ancestry DNA. Be busting them out left and right about a man raised a kid, then they upload they they DNA, you know, and everything to Ancestry, and then they have no match at all. And then they end up finding out not the kid. <laughs> not not the not the kid of the man. And it like, uh my thing is you you women that do that mess, go get pregnant by another man and try to put it on on another guy who love your your silly behind. Like I say, I I I I pray your life have calamity. All the days of your life, your life is not calamity. Not the child being calamity, but you. And, and I pray that child find out about your deception and your evil, and that child walk away from you and never want to speak to you again because that's wrong. That is so wrong. Anything? Do y'all feel like coming nope. clean, or is this nope. to the grave? No, nope. no, nope. to the grave. So who, he's doing what he got to do. What he's doing what he got to do. For the baby. Does the and, does um, the baby He's doing what he gotta do, you said? The, mm -hmm, the baby looks she looks like me. Okay. Ooh, honey, twin, honey. That's a twin. Looks just like me. Okay. <laughs> well, Don't yes, look just, like I was him. gonna ask I was gonna ask who the if the baby looked like the dad or the or the No, the no, no, no. Uh, no. How close is he with she, his cousin? She, um close enough. <laughs> Do you, do you intend oh you intend to stay married God. though? Oh yes. Are you still sleeping? Are you still sleeping with the the cousin? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, that's yeah. how it look. <laughs> and you, that's another reason, or I think reason number uh, two thousand and forty-eight and why a lot of men don't want to get married. Uh uh uh. Trifling, trifling. Trifling. Man, what didn't happen to our people? What happened? I told y'all a lot of these, a lot of these modern women today are degenerates. Straight up. That's some degenerate behavior. You have a whole baby with your husband's cousin. You still sleeping with him and talking about taking it to the grave. Like somebody didn't see this clip online that he knows and send him there. Cause they know your freaking voice. Give you an example. There are people that recognize me out in public and in different countries. Matter of fact, in several African countries I've been to, people have recognized me based on my voice. They, they heard me talking and they say, Hey, do I know you from somewhere? And I'm like, no, no, you sound familiar. Like this guy I always watch on the internet. You sound just like him. And then he look at me, like, wait a minute. You are like that sort of thing. There have been plenty of people have recognized me, even right here in Houston. I'm talking. They look and say, hey, Phil, like that hurt. So if they do that to me, and this is strangers, imagine the family of that husband. Boy, it's going to be some drama. It's going to be some drama when, when, when that husband find out. Oh, my Lord. Because I say this much, husband, if y'all know this husband, or this female that's watching this video, it's a small world. 
if you know the husband, tell him this, save that, save that recording, save it, everything that she's saying and take it to your divorce attorney and, 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 and try to get it where she can't get a freaking thing. That kid's not yours anyway. So you need to make sure if you sign that birth certificate, you need to, you can get off of it because that they deceived you. She deceived you. Get off that birth certificate because uh, you should be paying child support for a child not your own. Hell no. Now you got deceived. But let me know what y'all think about, you know, this situation here. I mean, this, this female here is like a straight demon, man, a demon. Yeah. I, I, I pray this man can get this footage and find out and get rid of her behind.